certainly the weather. Miss Woodhouse, please. What? Fate has left us alone for a reason. I do not seize your hand so much as the opportunity to declare Good that heavens. I... Good heavens, go back. Please. I am hoping... No. Fearing. Ready to die if you refuse me. Surely my ardent attachment to you, my love and passion, cannot help but have made an impression. Mr. And Elton, now... this is I, Miss Woodhouse. Mm -hmm. The party spirit has confused you. I'm happy to deliver your message to Miss Smith, but you must direct no more of it to me. Miss Smith? What sort of message would I want to send to her? <laughs> Miss Smith? Mr. Elton, the wine has weakened you for you to... If the wine has had any effect, it's been strengthened my will to tell you that I love you. My astonishment I... is beyond anything I can express. For you to address me in this manner after your behavior to Miss Smith... I never cared is... whether Miss Smith were dead or alive. Except that she was your friend. Who can think of Miss Smith when Miss Woodhouse is near? Oh, no. Everything I've said or done has been to prove my adoration for you. Why else would I go to London to have your picture framed? refrain from the intimacy of whispering. Am I to understand that you never sought to recommend yourself to Miss Smith? How can you be surprised? Did you not understand the riddle I wrote? That was for Harriet. I most obviously did not address it to her and left it at your home. But, oh. She's but a very good sort of girl, and I'm sure there are men who would not object to... Everybody has their level. But I need not so totally despair of an equal alliance as to address myself to Miss Smith. Sir. No! I sought to recommend myself to you Sir, through those visits. I and have I... seen you only as the admirer of my friend. I cannot believe that. It is well that the mistake ends where it That is her does. mistake. It is mine as well. She will manage her disappointment. Leave her out of it. How do you feel about what I have said? Mr. Elton. Any hopes I had with regard to you were for Harriet. And Harriet alone. Mrs. Weston. There has been an overthrow of everything I have been wishing for for Harriet and Mr. Elton. A development most unwelcome, most 